What's good, Makan fam? I'm Jono. I'm Josh. And today we're in Town Hall, the galleries, checking out Dalsat Cafe. Now, we're doing something a little bit different today to all the Makan vids. We're totally going to check out sweets. Ooh. And it's so good because I'm a massive sweet Me too, bro. And Me a too. massive sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> now, Dalsat Cafe that we're checking out today specializes in their 23 layer crepe cakes, and amongst all their other fancy desserts. Jono, I'm full keen. You know, I haven't had breakfast yet, so this is going to be oh. amazing. We're going to get on a sugar high. Let's, yeah, let's go. go. Let's go. So when, when people come here, they usually order one or two things between two people. Um, we have we only have... one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Oh yeah, too many. But too many. That's all for you. <laughs> let's let's try the melon soda. Yeah, you know what? We'll start off with the melon soda first. Tradition. Yeah. Traditional. Um, only reason drink. we're starting with the drinks as well is because there's ice cream in it, and it's sort of melting for that. It's pretty sick. Now, melon soda is like a staple drink in Japan. Find it literally everywhere. Macca's, KFC, petrol station, bathrooms. Um, yeah, it's everywhere. It's good. Oh. <laughs> you know when you have um, deja vu memories? Deja vu. Ooh. Yeah. We'll try the matcha one. Okay, you try the matcha So we've got the matcha. Look at that up close, guys. It's like a Milky Way within a cup. Wow. It's a matcha. Give it a try. It's got a vanilla ice cream there. Oh, this is nice. It's got matcha flakes on it. I mean, powder. Mm. That's refreshing. Like matcha, That's good yeah. matcha, yeah. It's good because... Uh, I actually like it cold. You like coffee? Try this one out. Oh. Yeah. I'm not a big coffee okay, drinker. Okay, I heard, I heard that this is, this is a lot of, like a fusion and it's got fruits in it. Yeah. Uh, what, peach? Peach so what do we got? Yeah, we got peach, yeah, um, peach and coffee in there, and a bit of green tea. Green <laughs> roasted. Tea. It's a roasted tea. Uh -huh. that, how do you pronounce it? Hoji. Hojija. Um. So with this yeah, drink, it's, yeah. a, it's called Hoko Pop. It would come with an infuse, uh, with a bubble, uh, with yeah. infused smoke. It would be coffee smoke. It tastes uh, a bit like Winnie Blues. <laughs> really? <laughs> Smells like pie. Oh, it smells amazing. Mm. Oh, that's so cool. Whoa. Whoa. Thank you, good sir. All right, tell us how it goes. Well, it's got, it's got a puree infused with green tea and uh, coffee and uh, as well. Oh, so, it smells amazing, guys. Amazing. All right, I'm gonna taste. I'm gonna taste this for you guys. Ooh. Good, bro. You know what? It's sweet, and it's got like that hint of coffee, like our uh, bitterness. But it's like it's so playful. You know, if you're if you're not a coffee lover, but you want to try coffee for the first time, I recommend this definitely. It's amazing. I reckon you would love this. You want to sip? You want to sip, bro? Yeah, I have this. I don't know, is this COVID safe? It's COVID because it's on the other side of the glass, it's all good. I mean, look, 
not a fan of coffee, so I don't know what to expect, but as a drink, it was alright. I love it. That's great. <laughs> what cakes do we have here? That looks amazing. So this is the mandarin mousse. That looks exactly mm. like a mandarin. Like, look at the jiggle on this, eh? Wow, that's amazing. If I didn't know that, guys? Yeah. It's it looks just like a real mandarin, eh? No, I'll peel it, but that's great. Is that a real orange leaf in there? I think that's real, yeah. yeah. Wow, look at that. Look at the layers inside. There's a mousse layer and then I'm guessing that's real mandarins in there as well. I'm just going to dig in because I'm super keen. How's that, bro? Mm. <laughs> I'm so happy. Yeah, I think it is real mandarin pieces in there and it's just a light, tangy kick. Yeah, it's amazing. I love mandarins. It's one of my favorite fruits. So if you give me mandarins for my birthday, I'll probably be happy. Yeah, let's go with the Earl Grey. Go with the Earl Grey. This is the... Um... Would you believe it, guys? Look, it doesn't look like Earl Grey. It looks like some... It's, it's white peach Earl Grey. White peach, yeah. White peach, guys. Mm. There you go. White peach, all great. Look at the adorable cut. It smells amazing. Mm. Mm. You could taste the all great. Mm. Definitely. Yeah. And the fruit, oh, the fruity flavor is great. This is a very light dessert, very smooth, and fruity. If you like Il Grey, that damn, that's that's the that's the dessert you should get. Thing looks okay. cute, bro. What is that? Um. This is a mango coconut mousse, but it's in the shape of like a little chicken, so you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Oh, wow, wow, look at that. that. Layers upon layers. Get a bit of cake in there as well. Mm. Coconut this is mango. a mango coconut, yeah, so all the coconut pieces in there and the mango as well. No, I'm just gonna dig in. How's that, bro? Very different flavors to um, the, the mandarin, mandarin one, yeah. but it's pleasant. You know, it's not too sweet, so you feel like you can eat a hundred of these. All right, Chano, what's next? This one, Give that a go. Yeah. the galleries uh, did a collaboration with a local artist and their theme was brush the dust off the wings. So this dish uh, from Dolcet is a little collab with them. As you can see, it's beautiful. But I'm already impressed. Look at the art. It's beautiful art on that. Mm. I'm shaking, guys. I'm shaking yeah. because it's beautiful. Jiggle, jiggle. So I'm going to dig in and I'm going to look. I'm going to cut through this beautiful art even though I don't want to, but I have to. Okay, guys. Beautiful cake. There's a chocolate um, chocolate foundation there, but I can't get it to cut. But that's what it looks like on the inside, guys. Have a look at that. If you're a chocolate fan or a mousse fan. Mmm. Whoa. Good. If you're a dark chocolate fan, this is the one. So rich. The inside filling, it gives a little bit of like a little sour flavor, uh, mm. sour taste. But it meshes well with the, the chocolate mousse. It's beautiful. It's got a nice texture to the mousse, I think. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's, it's really soft. Beautiful. Yeah. Moving on. All right, I'm probably gonna get a lot of flack for this, but I don't like chocolate, um, so I'm gonna go with <laughs> surprise. So I'm gonna go with the uh, the non-chocolate friendly ones. Um, Fine by me. You know what? Let's taste some of this. Man, I was eyeing that out from like yeah? from the start. Look at all the layering on that. Right, so this oh, is no. the rose lychee cake. Um, let's just dig in. Hey, I like the color. It's very nice, but yo. It's got like a crystal rose glaze. Yo! Is that a good cut or what? That's yeah. so clean. Look at this, guys. I'm just gonna dig in. Oh my goodness. goodness. Wow! Oh, that man. rose water flavor is very, what's the word, aromatic. The flavor goes up your nose as well, so. <laughs> Sorry, man. How good is it? Oh, I'm so yeah. happy. I'm very, I'm very surprised. Rose flavor is great. Yeah. Lychee flavors, you can taste yeah. the lychee flavor. I think I taste rose more than, than really? lychee. Really? Yeah. I can but taste both. Texture is so smooth, man. It's like, yeah. it's like eating clouds. Yeah, very good. That that glaze on top is great too. Yeah. We got the matcha right here. Matcha layer crepe cake. Matcha powder on top, guys. Beautiful. Look at that. Wow. Ooh, the, <laughs> I like the cups. And I cannot lie. And I cannot lie. Oh. Wow. It's a strong flavor, but not too strong. We've got a little bit of bitterness on it. Really? Good. The texture is the same as rose lychee, but mm. the powder on top adds a little kick, matcha kick. Yeah, it's a strong matcha flavor, but yeah, definitely. very pleasant. Like usually mm -hmm. some desserts you, when they say matcha, it's very overpowering, but I think everything works well with the crepes. Yeah. I, I guess that's a perfect yeah. match. Mm. Ah. <laughs> Mosan King. A durian flavored mm. crepe cake right here, layered crepe cake. To have this closed because the smell, <laughs> you know, it contaminates. I love it, it's like perfume. <laughs> oh, 
Beautiful, beautiful looking cake here. All right, ready? Go for the cut here. Oh, it's a big cut. slice, bro. Cut. So. Mm. <laughs> Yo. Hands down, favorite cake. Is it? Oh. I must be biased because, like, generally very strong in flavor. Like, not for the weak. Not for the weak, like me. Weak nose, weak, <laughs> weak taste buds, but it, it was a, it's amazing. Like, the cream, the durian flavor that it just combines together. Hands down, favorite cake. Well, I'm being biased. I love, I love durian. Even our cameraman, Brian, he's into, he's speechless, speechless. <laughs> but, Damn, you must try that. That's a must try. <laughs> we have a tiramisu layered crab cake. Beautiful. Um, it looks good, eh? Look at it. It's built beautifully. You can see all the lines clearly. In Indonesia, they have a cake similar to this. It's called kue lapis. It means layered cake. It takes a lot of time to make one of these. Great layers, eh? I'm going to cut through it. Oh, yo. Oh. Oh. Look at that. Mmm. <laughs> Tiramisu is good, but I think the cream on top sort of um, softens the tiramisu flavour. Nice. It's, it, you can only taste like a hint, hint of tiramisu, so it's not really uh, full on. Straight yeah, in the hatch. Yeah, it's not too bad. What we have here, guys, the coffee jelly. Look at the jiggle on that. The aroma as well. This is David's creation. This is a coffee, <laughs> coffee jelly. Look at that, beautiful jelly. The aroma smells like cold brew. What is that? We've got the milk. milk. Mm. Obviously smells like milk. That is slow pork. Oh. Wow. You guys were looking for a melting effect. Too bad, mm. it's jelly. Damn! Look at that. It's completely coated. I'm gonna dig in. Wow. Let That's me show you. Jelly. Let me show you the texture on that cut. Beautiful texture. Mm. <sighs> That's great. <laughs> Good job, David. I love it. If you're a coffee lover, this is a great dessert. All right, guys. I thought I was on a sugar buzz, but um, keep an eye out for our new short series called John and One Bites. He pretty much single-handedly finished all of this. <laughs> That was great. Yeah, that I don't know great. how you did it, man, but like, congratulations. You're not gonna sleep for the next three weeks, so. Nah, I'm, I'm gonna be on a caffeine buzz. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. But that was the Safe Cafe, guys. Um, just wanna say a special shout out to David um, for letting us in, um, uh, taking us behind the scenes and giving us all this awesome, awesome desserts. What do you reckon, Jono? What was your oh, favorite? My favorite was obviously the Musan King uh, durian cake. Mm -hmm. That was just intense in flavor. The ar aromatic is amazing. Yeah. Smooth texture. There was like, what, 23 layers yeah. of crepe. Each crepe, I think, crepe, each crepe cake had 23 layers yeah. and they're all handmade. Um, Imagine now, the process. Yeah, Dalsay prides itself on um, trying to hand make everything um, and not adding too much sugar into their desserts, which I think it makes great. it so yeah. nice. Yeah, A lot of combination of tangy yeah. and fruity. Yeah, because that's how we ate all of this, is because we, we didn't you know, get a sugar overload um, right away. Um, I like the rose, uh, rose lychee one. That, rose that was lychee was pretty damn good. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah. aromatic. Like, you eat it through your mouth and it goes in your nose as well, and it's like. The most attractive, good, yeah. the most attractive one was um, was that uh, brush brush the dirt off your wings, cake. Yeah. The, oh. Brush the dust off your wings. Oh yeah, that was pretty uh, colourful pretty as good, well. Yeah. Also yeah. the hoko pop jelly, uh, coffee jelly. That was also <laughs> very uh, pretty. He's on a sugar buzz right now. See his brain's going. The coffee jelly was great. <laughs> with, with this as well. <laughs> No, that was amazing. Um, as always, guys, uh, like and subscribe, hit that notification bell uh, to see more content like this. We're probably going to do a lot more um, dessert places oh, in the definitely. future. But we were planning to hit up two or three more places, but we're just full of sugar right now, so we're going to take it easy for the day. Um, watch out for a part two. Thanks, guys.